All right, <clears throat> what we have here is a uh, Oklahoma Joe Bronco uh, drum smoker or barrel smoker. And one of the problems with, I mean, this, this is a great smoker, I love it. It doesn't really have any problems, but this is a minor problem. Um, it's probably true with all drum smokers. Uh, if you look here with my last short cook, I lit this fire in the middle, perfectly in the middle. And you can see that the heat uh, moved over to the right. And so that means that the heat is going to rise straight up into your grate from the right. And the heat is not going to be on the left, it will be only on the right. And you might think, oh, it'll circ circulate around and it'll be perfect. No, actually, that doesn't happen. Actually, it rises up, hits the top of the pan, top lid of the uh, smoker, and eventually moves this, moves over to the chimney, to the stack. So, uh, and if you're curious and you take some, uh, some probes and put them on the grate, you will see that there could be up to a 90 degree difference. And so, uh, how do you fix that? I mean, there's various things you can do that I've experimented with, but uh, the best mod that I found was inspired by Weber. They've just come out with something called a heat controller, which is basically a steel disc which fits over most of the grate area and moves the heat to the side. Uh, so I tried that and it worked great. So I thought I would share it with you, uh, even though I don't really have a good 4K camera or any experience doing this kind of uh, YouTube video. So, uh, the first thing you do is with Oklahoma Joe Bronco, it has a heat deflector. So, you put that in there and try to center it as best you can. And then you take an 18 inch pie pan or two. Uh, obviously, this is going to get very hot, so I use two. Uh, pie pans here just lay them on top centered and obviously this is going to take the heat that you initially light in the middle and it's going to hit the top of the uh, heat deflector and the pie pans and the heat's going to move uh, to the sides but of course as the heat bleeds to the edge of the charcoal basket it's going to be uneven and even with the pie pans it's still going to be uneven so uh, you need a second in. So what I did is I cut a hole in, into this pie pan. This is an 18 inch pie pan. I cut a hole in it and fit it perfectly right over. And I can make this more snug by cutting notches here, which I will do. But for right now, uh, this works because I tried it out. So the heat comes up from the edges of the first pan and then moves to the center and rises in the center and so now you've got heat exactly the way you initially lit your charcoal pan the heat's coming up from the center however this is better heat this is convective heat rather than radiant heat and convective heat is your friend radiant heat is not your friend when it comes to low low and slow cooking so low and slow smoking you don't want radiant heat so this solves the radiant heat problem and also solves the bleeding problem. So you're not going to have uh, uneven cooking temperatures at the grate. The, grate the, the heat's going to be right in the center. And that might be nice if you're cooking a pork butt, for example. Uh, but if you're doing St. Louis ribs or baby back ribs, maybe that's not ideal. So what can you do to solve that problem? Uh, you can put another pan in, of course. Uh, so I'm going to take some uh, pieces of hickory here that I have, which I got from a, from Home Depot. These are uh, sold by by uh, uh, by one of the companies that makes uh, makes charcoal and also wood. It's called Jealous Devil. Uh, Jealous Devil will uh, serves these in a box. You can get an eight-pound box of these for eight dollars. At Home Depot, so you put that in first to hold the uh, the second grate. Uh, 
the, the Bronco only comes with one grate, so you'd have to buy a second grate or, you know, something else that would work. So you fit that in there like this, and then you put the pie pan in the middle. So this will take the heat, and it, that's rising in the middle, and obviously it'll deflect it to the edges. And if you have this perfect, perfectly centered, the heat will come evenly all the way around the, uh, the pie pan, and you'll have even cooking. And you don't have to use this pie pan. You could use any size you wanted. You could use a pizza pan of any uh, diameter that you wanted. Uh, I think it's 15 inches from here to here. It's 18 inches from here to here. Um, so uh, you could also use perforated pizza pans, which exist. Uh, you could use steel, steel pan of some sort. You could use perforated pans. You could use... Uh, cast iron I mean any diameter you want depending on what you want to cook or or whatever but and this this system works because I tried it I tried it on my short ribs and they came out perfect that was last night so uh, with that all you have to do is put the grate in and you've got perfect even heat all around this should work for any drum barrel smoker uh, so that's that.